The men's T20 ICC Cricket World Cup is scheduled across six Caribbean countries. Antigua and Barbuda, Barbados, St. Vincent and the Grenadines, St. Lucia and Trinidad and Tobago, alongside the United States of America from June 4th to June 30th, 2024. In St. Lucia, the cricket matches are scheduled for the 15th to the 24th of June, 2024. In an effort to facilitate the hosting of such a monumental mass crowd event, the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs, with the support of the Caribbean Public Health Agency and the Pan American Health Organization, has taken the proactive approach to ensure the comprehensive mass gatherings risk assessment for St. Lucia is done with the preparation plan. The Men's T20 ICC Cricket World Cup is classified as a mass gathering sports event and poses health challenges due to the concentration of large crowds. Host countries must be equipped for the early detection of outbreaks, potential bioterrorism threats, increased injuries and violence, ensuring timely and appropriate public health interventions for the safety and well-being of participants, spectators and the host country population. COFA has led the coordinated surveillance response to ensure robust health security measures are in place throughout the Caribbean. A potential health risk is posed due to the increased number of visitors arriving from diverse regions with diseases that are not endemic to the Caribbean. As such, St. Lucia has implemented enhanced surveillance systems at designated sites linked to the cricket matches a risk communication plan to identify the major health and information hazards during the hosting of the matches and to assess the levels of risk at the match venues is also in place. The main focus of this plan is to identify and implement communication mitigation measures for the hazards. This includes the education of spectators on disease prevention measures and hygiene practices. The laboratory capacity is also enhanced during the period with improved rapid testing of diseases of public health importance through the procurement of specified laboratory tests. This is focused on diseases not endemic to the region and biothreats. Arrangements have been made for referral to CAFA for specific tests. A team from CAFA will be on island to support the surveillance and laboratory testing. The health infrastructure readiness assessment was carried out to assess the readiness of human and other resources at local healthcare facilities to handle potential health issues including surge capacity for increased patient load. Medical services will be available at all match venues. During the period of the cricket matches from June 15 to the 24th, 2024, the Groselet Polyclinic will provide 24-hour health coverage. This will allow full access to care, especially for the late matches and other social events and parties. The Environmental Health Department will carry out vector control measures, including daily fogging of match venues to prevent the spread of vector-borne diseases. Stringent food safety standards at event venues, ensuring the safety of food and beverages served to participants and spectators. Infection prevention and control training has been delivered to key personnel at hospitality services and event and accommodation sites. Port health systems have also been strengthened. The Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs advises the public who attends a T20 cricket to take all of the necessary precautions to maintain health and wellness. Drink in moderation, do not drive under the influence, do not smoke in public spaces, stay home or seek medical care if unwell, avoid disputes that may end in violence, obey traffic guidelines, keep hydrated by drinking sufficient water during the matches and after every drink with alcohol, use mosquito repellent especially during the night matches and protect your skin with sunblock during daytime matches. Let us enjoy the spectacle of the ICC Men's T20 World Cup 2024 safely. <music>